I'm making a portable router table and I'm using the original sub base from my router as a template for where to drill the mounting holes into the tabletop. The sub base has a quarter inch wide through hole for the threaded part of the screw and a three eighths inch wide counter bore for the screw head to rest in. Now, if the material that I'm using for the tabletop was the same thickness as the sub base, I could just measure the depth of the counter bore and be on my way. But because the material for the tabletop is thicker than the sub base, what I actually need to know is how much material is left over. As in, what's the difference between the overall thickness of the sub base and the depth of the counter bore? Digital calipers work great for this. Using the depth gauge rod on the end of the calipers, I can zero them out and slide the depth gauge down until it contacts the bottom of the counter bore. Then I can zero them back out again, scoot the calipers towards the center of the hole, and slide the rod down again until it bottoms out, taking note of that reading. Now, physically, the calipers will be open to about the thickness of the sub base, but the reading will be the difference between the thickness of the sub base and the depth of the counter bore. If I close the calipers back down all the way and zero them out again, I can slowly open them up to the reading it gave me earlier and lock the head. I can then use the caliper step gauge to draw a line on the edge of a scrap piece to set the depth on my drill press. Measuring this way means no matter the thickness of the material I want to use, I will always drill out just the right amount of material. Deep enough for the threads to properly engage, but not too deep so the threads are at risk at bottoming out, just the way the original sub base was intended to be installed. 